Hey, uh, City Marshal, City Marshal Steve Pizant. How are you? Um, well, I'm a little stressed out. Yeah, we don't open till 8.30. Uh, well, I want to let you know that this building is a safety hazard. Are you coming this way? No, I got to go around another way. To get okay, it. it's a safety hazard. Have you seen that? The board up there? Have you seen that before? It's, okay, no, no, they don't have. It, could, it could fall and kill somebody. we get the city on the... Oh, letting everybody in. Okay. Everybody's coming in. Shanita, Steve. All right. <clears throat> Okay. Just uh, let the air, you know, take in all the fresh air I can. Okay, so whenever you get ready, yeah, just knock on the door. Knock on the door? Well, no, it's 9 o'clock. Yeah, but... And I'll be in maybe five minutes before I plan. 8.55, I'll, okay. I'll come in. And, knock and, and so you know, you can't take no kind of recording device. No. No, I'll have to keep them in my bag. Well, yeah. And, and, of course, you know... You like this? Go yeah. Yes. I'll have to keep it in my bag. I bicycled here. It's yeah, a, I see my, that. My car is a distance away. Because I I, I'm sure I'm going to jail. And I'd ask that you maybe clean the rust off your handcuffs for me if, <laughs> if you show some appreciation. <clears throat> but yeah, I mean, I got a bag of, of that I'll put it in. I mean, okay. I don't know what's going to satisfy the court. It's up to well, Judge Barber. That's correct. And you're 100% correct on that. Yeah. You're, yeah, you're okay. And you, have, have you, how long have you had body cams? I never noticed you with one oh, before. Body cams. You've had them for a while. Oh. Yep. Okay, all right, all right. Mm -hmm. I think, I yeah, we uh, got a mix of them. Yeah, this is a historical building. Uh, yeah, and I was here last night. I see you guys still uh, this flag. You took the Louisiana flag down, but you don't shine. You don't take this down at night, and you and you don't. Maybe you take the Louisiana flag down at night, and and, and you don't shine a light on it. We we don't fool with the flag flag at all. That's a that's a city. That's a city all right. Flag. Yeah, because there, there's a flag code um, that that people follow. And, well, I'm yeah. you're called city marshal. I was just saying, as yeah. part of the city. That's uh, that's something. It looks a little beat up too. It might it might be up for retirement soon, <laughs> soon enough. But yeah, usually, I mean, I was here last night. Usually, there's a light that's shined on the flag as part of flag code, or it's taken down every night. One of the two options. So am I am I am I off the warrant list? Oh, you got it, Steve. P, uh, Sorry, City Marshal Pizant. Am I off? Steve. Steve. Steve, just Steve. Okay. Am mm -hmm. I off the warrant list, or what's going on with the uh, arrest warrants? Um, you know. Yeah. I mean, as uh, you know, started out at NCIC. I turned myself in. Took the second time before I finally got taken off. I found out on the third time that I was taken off NCIC. And then I get into Louisiana, into Lincoln County, north of here, and uh, they said I was, well, they didn't see me at all, but I showed them the paperwork. They, I guess you guys don't hand out, but I got from the city court uh, the warrants that Judge Barber signed, well, that, he, that Shanita signed, actually. Judge Barber was just a witness or something. But, uh, yeah, I mean, are you, are you is there, it's in, I was told it was inactive up there. I guess I'm confirming that. Correct. It was it, put into an inactive status. You, did you take me off? Were you the one who took me off of it? You, you put me on it. You take me off yes. of it, right? Okay. And inactive. Okay. That's a that's a unique status. 
right? There's act, there's like, it exists and doesn't exist, and there's active and inactive. Is that like? So you can have a active, inactive, and recalled. And it's not recalled. Well, I I, I was, I have not got a anything official saying it has been recalled. I did get notified that you had signed a new court notice. If I'm nope. to understand. That was that was notice? nope. That that was supposed to be what they were to receive was a court notice. I would like to see that. I don't know. I, 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 that, listen, I only get what's emailed to me of what to do, but yeah, that's yeah. why it was inactive because I did not get a recall notice from the DA's office or the city court saying hmm. that it was recalled. That, okay. And I was told you signed a new court notice for today. No. Nope. Be here today. No, no, I didn't sign anything. That's they said that uh, some kind of paperwork is coming in, but it was unclear how long it was going to take. I'd, I'd like to look at a copy. Whoever submits that, I, I don't. I'd have to talk to Shanita. It's probably. If I had to guess, it'd be the district attorney's office. Yeah, because they're the ones handling the case. It ain't us. We just do what they give us. Okay, there's some, it's supposed to be something I signed that that uh, Lincoln County. They said come back on Tuesday. <laughs> so I'm, I'm gonna. There again. Yeah, you don't know. I okay. I only get. I, I'm the last to get the information. Yeah, you're the go-between. Yeah. I mean, yes. I only, just I only can do what I, I'm given I, to do. Okay, so maybe the warrant might still be active. Here's, no, so I know oh, it's not. You, active. you did it on the computer. I okay. know it's not active. Okay, then I do know that. We just needed to take a further step, which wasn't done, and I'll need to talk to the district attorney about that. Okay. Well, okay. I mean, but. Inactive and is not exactly like recall, but it no. But it, nobody show it doesn't it, give them ability to rescue on it because they can't see that it's active. Yeah, and, and in Lincoln County, he only checked NCIC. He said it. Lincoln Parish. Okay, Lincoln Parish. He he only checked NCIC. So um, yeah, I, okay. I'll just I'll leave it at that. If it's okay. Yes, I, like I say. I can only give and do what yeah. I'm given. Yeah, you're I, I'm, even even incomplete. See, the thing is, I think you should lose your your license to input into NCIC uh, because, well, in Lincoln's parish, he said that uh, they only see arrest or don't arrest, but they don't see extradite or don't extradite. They don't see that. That's again, only information not given can I enter. Uh, but I mean, still. It, it, uh, the way this turned, way this played out, it, it, it was a waste of time for all of us with the NCIC. There again, it's, I can only do what yeah, I'm you, instructed yeah. to do by someone else. Yeah, and all right, I, and I hope to help them see that this was a waste of time for all of us. I'm not. I'm just saying it as I understand. I'm echoing it. I'll echo it to, at the court if if I can. I'm sure I'm going to have to talk about this warrant issue with them. So I got a statement prepared. I'm going to read. I'd rather have a lawyer, uh, you know, stand in my place and, and talk to the judge. But, you know, it's, it seems a little difficult around in this state to do that, to have a representation. So, yeah. So uh, I know that you uh, you ran for sheriff. Is, it, uh, is there any anything you think that you could have done better when you ran? Any, any uh I don't know, another hand you could have shaken or another event you could have attended no, when you when you attempted to run for sheriff. Oh no. Best you did the best you could do. That's with the circumstances. Okay. All right. Well, you know, things played out the way they do. It's, That's right. You know, well we have the country we live in. Yeah. Yeah. It's, well it's, we have the country we live in. There's yeah, let the people speak. That's correct. You know, it's one hundred percent. You know, um, on on, and, on this and it is what it is i wish i wish the people could speak uh it for my trial today's a trial for me today so i wish i had a jury who could you know listen to this but you know people can't speak for everything at least for elections and yeah that's yeah that's how they've yeah have it worked out for louisiana so well that's how every uh, state in this country is done on its elections y yep yeah. Well, some some elections uh, a little a uh, little uh, uh, tighter than others. I, I don't know. 
I was going to ask another question just to change the topic. I thought it was kind of amusing for myself. Uh, have you ever bought anything from uh, Officer McFerrin? No, okay, all right. I'm, I know, I'm curious. Yeah, I look like it. No, I mean, <laughs> well, not with. I'm thinking that that's all you got caught with. I think there's probably, you know, that's just the surface, in my opinion. But I mean, I, I want to ask people. I'm going to ask around if, if anybody's bought anything from Officer McFerrin. So yeah, it was uh, it was a steroid thing. Yeah, and, and I'm hearing that co the other cops are saying it's just steroids. It's no big deal, but. I mean, within the police station, an officer and, and that, which is illegal, it's, it's concerning to me. And I wonder, I wonder if my arresting officers may have been, I mean, he was working with them at the time. It concerns me. Are, 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 you, are you told who, who to expect today? Like any witnesses? You probably, you don't know. Yeah, you don't know. Okay. I'm just, I'm nervous and stressed out about this. So it's, I'm, I, I'm just babbling on, so. Completely understand. Yeah. All right. Yeah, all right. All right. Yep. I'm good. Somebody with some boxes walk in. They're all entering through the front. Bananas are gonna spoil. I didn't even get around to finishing those. And I, yeah, I saw Judge Barber walk in. Well, yeah, about a couple minutes ago, I think. So, yeah, he's... Uh, my first time ever meeting the man. I, you never met him? I didn't I didn't come to court the last time, y'all. Yeah, it's... I think Randy came that day. Oh, yeah, Randy Williams. He's taking the day off. No, he's serving papers right now. All right. Morning, how you doing? Morning, Watch, be friend. careful. It's a safety hazard up there. There's a board hanging. It's just, yeah, yeah, no big deal. Good morning, Clyde Benjamin. Hey, be careful, there's a safety hazard. There's a board hanging off the ceiling. Good morning, sir. Good morning. No? Who was it? See, so, yeah, I gotta throw everything in my bag and, yeah. Is that your bit. bicycle? Yeah, I, okay. I have a lock on the back tire. Okay. I, I mean, I. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get thrown in jail for something. So I don't want to leave my car around here. I don't The computer automatically pushes his name onto the your paper. It's set in the computer. Well, it can't it can't do that. It, if you need minutes where it says approved, I can take that off. You just take it. Well, then who will approve it? Is Okay, okay. All right. So yeah, I mean, you, I mean, it's not on you because you're just, you're just the, uh, the clerk. I mean, you, you don't, you're not the one to stop this. Well, you can stop it, but it's, it's, it's on him to be aware of that. I mean, it's, it looks like there's impropriety with. No, he's not on your case at all. Yeah, uh, but it, I mean, it, I mean, I see his name right here. I mean, what does, what does that give uh, uh, if somebody walked in and saw this? Yeah, they might think that you know he's a part of it. I mean, I can I can give you the correct minutes if you need. Them. Okay, all right. So when it's just kind of he doesn't look at this, but he still approves it, right? No. Oh, he does look at it. No, he doesn't look. Tell my judge Alsley. Judge Alsley does not look at the minutes, but he still approves it, right? Because it's an automatic. Yeah, it's automatic, but he doesn't look at it. Okay, so he's just he's just approving things without looking at them, right? He didn't approve it. He didn't approve this? No, he's well, not on it, the case. It says approved by Judge... It's automatically in the system. Yeah, but it, and, and he did not look at this, right? No. Okay, so he's a, he's approving things but not looking at them. I mean, I mean that's what I'm seeing. I, okay, we're going in circles. You're right. I don't mean... Okay. 
I'm just, I'm, I'm just making, I don't, I'm sorry. You, thank you. That's, I was going too far. With, I'm asking, okay, so the next minutes, you'll need a couple of days. Probably by tomorrow. To, by tomorrow is good. Okay. All right. Uh, yeah. All right. And then I'll try to file in a different way. Instead of just emailing you, I'll file in a, my motions in a different way. Okay. Submitting on paper. Okay. Okay. If you get an injured defender, they'll file your motions. Well, but until, you know, yeah, until, yeah. All right, thank you, sorry. Have a great day. Yeah, I, I might be back, because I got to file uh, some motions. But you're open, I mean, yeah, you guys, you're open to 4.30. Okay. Yeah, all right. Hey, is the warrant office uh, somewhere? Where's the warrant office? Uh, warrant office? Yeah, like uh, I have, or no, what am I saying? Bond, like the office for bonds. Um, no, we have an office for bonds, but we can do bonds over here. Yeah, because uh, uh, when I had um, somebody pay for a bond for me a few months, a few couple of years ago, um, they uh, did. They had the officer standing at a desk and filling out this notebook paper, uh -huh. and then she handed him $1,500. And it was an officer. I, I could look at his picture. Maybe, maybe I could show you a picture of him. I'm sure I've never been here that long. Okay. Yeah, and I'm interested in the status of my my uh, that that money that that uh, bond. Is that is it all familiar to you? I think I know what you're talking about. Hold on. They paid cash only. It cash. It was cash only. Yeah. There was no bondsman avail, uh, involved. Okay. Hold on. Hey. As of November 1, the city police will be collecting 2% bond fee along with a $15 bond. <clears throat> yep, uh, uh, so I'm interested in the status of my bond because I, I got an FTA. All right, so that, that, that uh, makes me wonder what the, the status would, would be uh, okay. if, there's, if it's changed or whatever with you guys. I'm just I'm here to learn. So if you didn't go to court, you would have got a bench warrant, which yep. is the FTA. Yep. Okay, you didn't go to court, right? On the 18th, on October 18th, but then I got it all quashed uh, by turning myself in five times. And then... Uh, and now I'm just interested in the status of if it's changed with you guys. I know the city marshals put me in and took me out, to, put me in on two levels and then took me out on, on two levels. And, and uh, I was wondering if the communication is done with uh, the bond. The, the okay, so you would have to go to city court. Um, okay. That's, you know, right across the street right there. So the bond wouldn't be through unless you... It was... Okay. Right. Did you pay money? It was $1,500, $100 bills. Where did you pay it at? Oh, all right. I should show a picture of this, I guess. Yeah, it was. it's paid at the uh, police station. And I believe I got a picture. Let's see here. Okay, I just, I need to look. Uh, okay, there. So yeah, somebody took a picture of, of paying. I just have to find it. Images. Up. Because I, I know I saved it on a computer. I mean, I don't know how much it'll help, but uh, I think... Oh, come on. No? Mm. Yeah, it's... But for him to get his money back, he'd have to have paid it from next door, right? Right. Okay, maybe I... Okay, I... I I'd really have to look. Uh, yeah, it was paid at the police station.
insurance, my uh, uh, insurance of justice license. Damn it. You don't need to own digital, do you? Uh, I guess so. I'm not. Uh, no, you can do both. You can do both. Oh, I guess. I, I guess I don't. All right. What's that? Okay. Yeah, it should be under you guys. Uh, okay, the bond happened uh, in 2022 at about uh, April, May, about May, May 2022. Okay, yeah, I got, um... Okay. Do you, maybe maybe the contract seeing the contract might help Check. You have to mail. Well, um, I, yeah, I can. I can give one. I just have okay. to. You want to write it down? Yeah. Well, uh, dang it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's the. That's the next step. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. I'll just. I'll have to come back. Okay. Give me a mailing address, and then once the city court sends me the docket, oh, we have to um, request it from the city, and then we'll be able to mail it to you. Okay. All right then. Thank you. Yep. Hi. Um, I was just in court today and I had Judge Barber approve me of a court appointed attorney and he said that the minutes will be ready tomorrow. Well, the clerk said the minutes will be ready to t uh, tomorrow to show you guys that I'm approved by him directly. And so I just, uh, I don't know, I'm mentioning that, and if there's anything you could you have to add to that, I'd, I'd be willing, you know, I'm, I'm here to learn. What's your name? Travis Hines, H-E-I-N-Z-E. -E. Okay. 
Ah, uh, it's okay. It's twelve twenty four seventy five. Well, it's the thing. I, I think I want to, I, I can, I could do all that. I just, uh, yeah, I could get prepared ahead of time before I receive the minutes. They'll be ready tomorrow. The clerk, the city court clerk said, um, but yeah, I, I guess I could fill out information in advance. And when, she, when I get the minutes, then I'll, I'll take I'll have the minutes and the paperwork together to bring in. I could, yeah, whatever you guys have, have. Yeah, that's just, that's my process. So since you're here, let me go ahead and have you do some updated information, and then we'll go from there, okay? Okay. So I can take this with me? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, these this will be asking it a uh, second time. But I mean, I'm talking about, you know, you know what court minutes are? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, is the, the details and the minutes won't be there. It would have to be the transcript. Would the transcript help more? Need your information regardless. Yeah. Oh, okay. You'll you'll read it twice. You don't care, right? You'll. You well, he asked the same. He asked the same questions. Alimony, dependents living in the home. That's for me, for my office. Yeah. Yeah. That's that's for him too. Whatever they have at their office is their office. No, it was during court. It was it was, it was on the record. Yes, but so. I still need it for my files. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Sounds good. <clears throat> so what you can do is just uh, take it with you. you know, if they say anything, they might tell you to bring yourself on and put it back in the hand. Or just see what the name will say. So I'm thinking it's going to be the clerk of carts. Okay. So, what do you need to do? The clerk of carts. Okay. You can take your stuff to the clerk of court's office. I'll be getting in the hallway to you right now. Oh. <laughs> oh, uh, all right. Does it say anywhere we don't need to be scanned? Or? No, that's only if you're going past the first floor. So past the first floor. Yeah, yeah the sir. second floor. Second floor, it's for courtrooms. And uh, judge's office. That's where you want to scan. You want right. to scan you down here, make sure you have everything. Not oh, I tell I tell you, and you, it's an on your honor thing. If I tell you I'm going on the first floor, but really the second floor. Yeah. And, well, uh, we got another set. Hey, of, oh, check one. Yep. Done. I seen that. Yes, sir. So yeah, the so, I think it's straight down. Yes, it's straight down to your right. Yep. Yeah. 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 So do we want to talk to you? Yeah, I want to uh, sue the library. So, what's what's the paperwork I need for that? Um, you'll need to go to the end of the hall, take the stairwell down. When you open the door, civil department. Okay. All right. Thank you. Looks like it takes me outside. Civil office. Oops. Hello? Oh. Hello. Oh, I want to sue the library, so what paperwork do I need? Okay. You need to um, provide a petition. Okay, so I'll, you, you want to open, you want me to draft it all myself, mm -hmm. and then uh, I pay the money. Um, it's $350. To yeah, buy. and if I'm approved by a judge uh, that uh, to be indigent, indigent, I could show you the minutes from that hearing, and then that would uh, make it a uh, waivable. 
uh, fee. Okay. Yes. Sir. I'll get to, I'll get those minutes tomorrow. I'm just trying to think ahead of time uh, how to prepare. And you're saying to draft uh, a motion of some kind, like just put put all the arguments in there. Just have you know a good 25 pages of arguments about why uh, I'm, I'm suing the library. It's all. It just you, has to be in a legal document form. Yeah. Okay. You want it all up front right at the start. Perfect. Okay. Because I, I was wondering, you know, if I maybe set an appointment and then um, then oh, uh, there would be, uh, um, like, they would be notified, the library would be notified. They only get notified after I submit my... Correct. Along with your... Okay. Filing. Okay. Then I'll, I'll get my arguments ready and then I'll submit them to you. Along and, with your fee. And oh well, I'm gonna have that wave. Okay, that's one thing I want to get. Uh, do I? Um, what do I show uh, for? I got. I'll have the minutes. Do I show you Are guys? Are you trying to file Popper? Yeah. Well, yeah, Popper. Yeah. Okay. Did you try City Court? Well, it's not a small claims. Okay. I just. Uh, yeah. City I just, Court also accepts. Um, yeah. <laughs> I went to ChatGPT and it said uh, it's kind of a waste of time. Uh, for uh, just because they they've banned me for life, and so I want to sue them to be unbanned. And and city court is is not exactly the medium for that, according to ChatGPT, which I trust almost a hundred percent. So I'm coming. That's why I'm coming to you guys. And uh, yeah, it was the chat. It was it was a city judge who approved me of being a pauper or indigent. I think those are the same thing, being pauper and indigent. And and but I, I think I still for the lawsuit need to be to bring it to district court, and I, I'm sure that the, the the waiver for indigency should still stand from city court to uh, district. Or to district. You don't to think so? District court. Okay, then the district judge would then they would see what the city court decided, and then they would make their own decision, right? Okay. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Do you deal with the waiver stuff here? I would submit, okay, then I'll just come back uh, okay. when I get the minutes. Okay, okay. thank you. Yes, <clears throat> Hello, Dave Stamey. Hey, how I, you I doing? Need, I need to work with your office. I'm going to be suing the library to get my uh, lifetime ban lifted. And, but, and I got uh, Judge Barber, who is out of Shreveport. Right. He approved me of being a pauper, so I'm, I'm poor well, enough. We can't take, we can't take pauper stuff, because I know you got money. You think, well, Judge Barber doesn't think I got money. Yeah, it doesn't matter, I'm what it matters. You're, what? <laughs> no, I think it's a judge that matters. Ah, no, he's an import. He, he is an import. He is an import. No, the judge decides. You're you're kidding, right? I mean, they they're changing some things up. They're saying that uh, the clerk can decide if uh, popper status or not. It's the judge. Yeah, you're but just because, um, because we don't make any money if it's popper. No, oh, that's unfortunate. But it's I shouldn't have been kicked out for life anyway. This is so. Here's the deal: popper postpones payment. Oh, okay. So if I lose. Know, then I'd have to. No, if you lose or win, but you don't have to pay up front. Oh, so that that, huh. that that helps. Well, I would ask them to pay for my all my fees. Absolutely. That's the next Absolutely. step. That would be okay. Absolutely. And I've warned them. I've told them I'm gonna sue, and they're not responding. I can't just walk over and say I'm gonna sue either because I'm I'm banned for life. I emailed them and called. That's the best I can do. Yeah, and they don't. Unless, they unless don't you respond. could, con if you have contacts with them, let them know that I'm intending to sue. I, but it's, they. they uh, they they um, they won't respond to your email. No, I'm not getting any response. No, I asked for the director. Well, that's nope. ridiculous. I hate to sue him, but I mean, if, if, if I'm looking into it because I'm here yeah. for my yeah, my hundred a thousand and twenty five days now. My my this case is active with the city court. Right. And next trial is in February. So, yeah. That's, oh, so I, do you? So you don't really need to sue until February. Well, I, I need to sue now because I'm, I'm here and gotcha. I'm, I'm not gonna. I have to stick around. I'm not. I'm not. Yeah, it's is a thousand. I drove from Michigan down here now, and now I'm here. And but the weather's so much nicer here. Uh, well, I'm sweating a lot. <laughs> um, okay, but yeah, I'll, I'll be. Yeah. I'll be back here tomorrow. Perfect. So okay. I'll All right. Yeah. Wait, 
Hey, um. Okay. All right, I, I want to properly file this because George Barber didn't accept it by email and it takes about two pages. So I guess to properly file it, I have to write it. And I'm curious, would you be able to borrow two pieces of paper, blank paper that I could write on or should I just do it on these line paper to write my, to write my writs? I don't need lines. This is this doesn't have any lines. This is I want to properly file this, and I'm I'm gonna get the impression that I need to actually write it out. So you want copy paper? Blank blank paper because two pages blank paper maybe you can do that. Okay, thank you. <clears throat> Alright, I want to file this. So I guess I'll need like stamps or and I also um I can I can email copies. I took pictures of that. So I can email copies to the prosecutor or uh, unless you want to give me copies I can hand them hand deliver them to the prosecutor. I'm, it's more important that the court receives it though as far as I understand. And I have more, more to come. I guess I'll just rewrite the, what I have. It's just like qualify for the corrected copy. Oh, oh, I got gotcha. you. All right. And since I am a qualified to be a pauper, I'd request to have transcripts for free. Oh, this is my copy? Yeah. Oh, because you made copies. Okay. Okay. Yeah, all right. So is that is that something that you, you do, transcripts? You could get on them transcripts for October 18th and, and uh, today? You can request them. Yeah, I am. I'm requesting them right now. In, in white. Okay. Well, I can just write in the back of this. I mean, is that okay? I, I request... I re Sure. Well, yeah, I'm gonna go off, of course. Which way? Which way? I'm going to the the prosecutor's office. I'm gonna submit this. Yeah, step right on. Well then. Oh, just step. Okay. Yeah, just over here. Yep. Submitting several motions, but that's the start. Okay. So we're good. Yeah, right, just thank you. You, you got it. to submit a uh, motion
Okay. Then also, uh, the city marshal said that they won't release the uh, my voice recorder to me unless the court gives them a um, permission. Going to the prosecutor's office. Put any metal you got put in that tree. Oh yeah, okay. The backpack and whatever you got on your there, what you do there. Yeah. On, on the table there. Any other metal you got on you put in that tray. Alright. Walk through here without touching anything. Okay. Now I need to see you and all of this stuff you got. You just you will show it to me. I won't touch it. Oh, okay. See all the way to the bottom of this right? Oh, all right. Okay, put it back there. I see it. Oh. Mm -hmm. This is clear. That one is. Mm -hmm. <coughs> This pen thing That's fell out, I, I so I just I wanted to, to, wanted to put it back in there. Pack that down so I can see all the way to the bottom. Pack this? Okay. There you go. Okay, now. Yeah. Oh, yeah, there's... Right. Okay, all right. Here. Right. Let's see. 
Anything in that canister? Oh, it's going to work up? You got anything in this canister? Yeah, sure. What is it? Uh, water. What? Somebody. There's somebody in there. 